Buying from brands that don't pollute the earth and contribute to human suffering should not be a luxury. Hi, my name is Olga Rojas and this is Live and Wear and Eat channel. In today's video, we're going to discuss with you how to shop sustainably on budget. I know that uh, once you hear the word sustainable, right away you think of something very luxurious and expensive, but that's not right. So today I want to prove you and give you some tips and my thoughts about that, how you can find really good deals on sustainable uh, garments. I just want to give you a little setting of my life so you understand that I don't have funds months of like a thousand dollars to spend on sustainable brands so i'm a mom of two little girls uh, me and my husband will live in new york city so the lifestyle here is very expensive uh, i don't work so i'm a stay-home mom and my husband is the only one supporting the family so obviously, unfortunately, we don't have, as, uh, as I mentioned already, $1,000 to spend um, on my clothing uh, per month to buy from sustainable brands. But I knew that I need to find the way to change because I saw that I have so many clothes, but I had nothing to wear, like most of us, right girls? And then um, I decided to make a move. The first thing I did, I was trying to streamline my wardrobe. So I sorted out the things and you actually can watch um, a video about that that I made the last month, how to um, build your sustainable wardrobe. So the first thing I did, I um, sorted out all the clothes that I no longer use. They were for some reason maybe too small for me or maybe they, I don't just use them as much as I wish. So all those clothes, the first First thing I did, I of course I cleaned them, I ironed them, and I took really nice pictures and I posted those pictures on such app. You might heard about it, it's called Poshmark. Personally, I found Poshmark very easy app to use, so I'm going with this app, but you are free to use any other reseller's uh, app um, as you want. So while I was waiting for my Poshmark sales to pop up, I was doing my research on ethical brands. I just wanted to let you know, guys, at the very beginning, that here the main concern about uh, shopping ethically and sustainably is about the way we think. So besides quitting fast fashion brands, you actually need to quit fast fashion way of thinking. You know, every time you enter a fast fashion store, they kind of push new collection and they want you to buy more and more. And this way you never really feel satisfied with your wardrobe. So here you need to analyze this and change this mindset. Every time when you're about to buy a new garment, you need to ask yourself if you're gonna wear and use this particular piece more than 30 times. That's a golden rule in in shopping sustainably. Every time you say yes, then you go for it and you click on that button or you give your credit card. If you are thinking that you might not, probably you're not gonna wear that as many as 30 times, then you need to say maybe no for, for this time. And the time you say no, you achieve a big goal of living sustainable lifestyle. It's very important to learn to say no to the things we actually don't need. Here comes the biggest secret of shopping sustainably. Sustainable shopping is not expensive. I'm gonna tell you why. Yes, sometimes when you look at the garment, you can see that garment costs you maybe $400 or $300. But think of that garment that every time you're gonna use that garment, you you can uh, divide that price in 30. Remember, you're gonna use that garment 30 times. Imagine that the coat costs you $300. So every time you're actually gonna wear it, you end up paying just as much as $10. Personally, I consider any garment, even from non-ethical, sustainable brand, that you buy pre-loved already sustainable, just because you are not supporting, you're not contributing to a new production of clothing, which is good for the environment, it's good for the, the seller, so he gets the funds, it's good for you, it brings you joy, but remember that you need to follow the list of the things of the garment you're actually missing, so fill in those capsule gaps. 
So you really need to take it more conscious and analyze your wardrobe, what you're actually missing. So this way, when you buy something pre-loved, it's a win-win situation. Everybody gets out of it the best. Another thing, of course, try to set a budget, a monthly budget that you are going to spend uh, the money on shopping sustainably, because we have to be very conscious how much we're consuming every month. And it's gonna help you just to avoid those uh, you know, impulsive uh, shopping decisions. The most unsustainable way of taking your wardrobe from being regular to sustainable is to send all your clothes to the landfill and go and spend a thousand dollars on sustainable brands. That's the least you want to do while becoming more sustainable. Of course, it does take your time and most importantly, it takes lots of patience, patience to build your uh, sustainable wardrobe. So you will eventually get there, just you need to take one step at a time. Another tip I can recommend you is of course to follow some of the ethical brands on Instagram or on any other social uh, platforms. Uh, this way you can be the first one to know about maybe their annual sale or they send you some uh, private discounts. So this is a really good way to shop on budget sustainably. Another thing you can do is of course to follow ethical sustainable fashion bloggers and thank you so much guys for uh, watching this video I really hope to be helpful and of course you can follow me on Instagram I'm trying to share there as well some tips and tricks on sustainable lifestyle along with other interesting stuff just from my daily life one more thing I would like to mention is to a shop off season for example I got really nice Burberry dress uh, just for $30 on Porsche mark unfortunately it was in September but then a good thing there was not too much noise and rush about purchasing it so I really need a white dress of a good quality so that was a good timing another fun things I would like to recommend you is swap parties invite your friends over bring unwanted clothes and just rock sustainable runway with your friends thank you guys so much for watching this video I really hope it was useful and you learned something new please invite your friends to the journey of sustainable world and yes guys i'll see you in the next videos bye